So this afternoon, in one hour, residents will urge the Gretna City Council to pass a resolution opposing a third coal export terminal proposed in Plaquemines Parish that could bring mile-long trains of uncovered coal through the heart of the historic city. WDSU reporter Andy Cunningham is live now in Gretna with more on the debate that's expected to get pretty heated tonight. Andy? Scott, they are expecting a packed house tonight behind me here at Gretna City Hall for this ongoing battle to stop this proposal, you could say, in its tracks. Now, this is a plan years in the making and would not only increase rail traffic through the heart of Gretna's historic district, but the proposal to add a third ram coal terminal in Plaquemines Parish would also allow uncovered coal trains with up to 150 cars long to pass through the city en route to Ironton. Creating growing concerns about health, property values, as well as public safety. That's why a large group of opponents, from residents to business owners to environmentalists, are expected at tonight's meeting to once again ask the city council to oppose the construction of this new terminal. You know, I don't understand why the council, why is it so hard for them to stand with us? The citizens of Gretna, we elected them to protect us. We want them to act on our behalf, not, not the coal company, not the railroad. What about the citizens who live here? Now, city officials do not have the authority over the rail industry because it is federally regulated, but what they can do is certainly voice their opposition to the project as well as propose alternative plans. One possible resolution that could come to the table tonight, we're told, is a possibility of rerouting these tracks out of Gretna. Now, that meeting begins at 5.30. Reporting live on your side from Gretna, I'm Andy Cunningham. Scott, back to you.